2024 Ford Mustang GT Convertible First Look Review, 7th Heaven Few things are as American as the Ford Mustang, but the original pony car has now been around for almost 60 years. With six generations under its belt, the Blue Oval has found ways to up its game with the launch of the seventh-generation Ford Mustang recently. This comes at a time when many manufacturers are focused on cutting down on emissions-heavy power plants, so the automaker seemingly flies in the face of that by giving us the V8-powered Mustang GT in both coupe and convertible guises with more power than ever before. And with edgy new styling and an interior to wow the younger crowd, the drop-top Mustang will likely sell in high numbers. Internally dubbed the S650, it might only be a heavily revised version of the old car, but that won't diminish its light at all in a world where combustion is a four-letter word for all but the most committed gearheads. When is the Ford Mustang GT Convertible coming out? The release date for the 2024 Ford Mustang GT Convertible is set for the summer of 2023, with the current-gen models carrying over until then. That means the 7th Gen Stang will arrive as a 2024 model. Ford Mustang GT Convertible Price and Competition Ford hasn't shared the price of the 2024 Ford Mustang GT Convertible just yet, but the current model goes on sale for $48,565 MSRP. We expect the new version to cost around $50,000 when it arrives in the USA next year. Fellow American and chief rival, the Chevrolet Camaro Convertible is priced from around $45,000 in LT1 guys, it comes with a 6.2-liter V8 engine that makes 455 horsepower. Just as the new Mustang range hits the market in 2024, the Camaro will be done away with, however, to pave the way for electrification. Meanwhile, Dodge is offering a convertible Challenger for the 2023 model year, but it costs a pretty penny and isn't an official Dodge product, outsourced to a custom fabrication company despite being orderable through dealerships. New Ford Mustang GT Convertible Exterior and Colors Since the Mustang nameplate is an American staple, Ford had to find a way of refreshing the new Genstang to keep it relevant while retaining the iconic looks that identify it for what it is. And for the most part, we think the automaker stuck to the brief. Each variant in the lineup gets a unique aesthetic, GT models have a much more aggressive front end with large openings for improved airflow, and there are also new hood vents and a front splitter that has been updated. There are new tri-bar LED headlights that echo the triple chevron look of the taillights. Speaking of which, the rear end is much more modern and chiseled with wider haunches to hint at its power. The new Ford Mustang GT Convertible comes with one-touch activation for the roof via a single handle center latch. The fabric roof itself is fully lined and insulated. The GT Convertible rides on 18-inch wheels, but 19 and 20-inch items are available. The GT is also easily identifiable with a GT rear badge and 5.0 badges on the front fenders. Ford tells us that colors for the Ford Mustang GT Convertible No. 11 in total and include two new shades called Vapor Blue and Yellow Splash. With new stripe colors and designs, the exterior of the Ford Mustang GT Convertible is even more customizable than before buyers can also opt for black, red, or grabber blue brake calipers. And if you want even more exclusivity, the Mustang Design Series appearance package is all new and adds sinister bronze wheels and a host of exterior accents in bronze. Ford Mustang GT Convertible Dimensions We were pretty sure the new Stang models would be larger and wider than the outgoing versions, but since the seventh generation will be built on the same platform as the old car, it may be better, but it's not necessarily bigger. Key dimensions for the Ford Mustang GT Convertible include a wheelbase of 107 inches, a length of 189.4 inches, and a width of 75.4 inches, excluding the side mirrors, 81.9 inches in total. The GT Convertible stands 54.8 inches tall. Due to all the added mechanics for the roof, the convertible models are the heaviest in the range, with the manual gearbox, curb weight is 3,916 pounds, going up to 3,932 pounds for the automatic. Ford Mustang GT Convertible Engine and Performance Back when Ford threw a four-cylinder engine in a Mustang, fans weren't overly excited. 
And while the EcoBoost variants may have redeemed themselves, true enthusiasts want more muscle. For 2024, Ford gives those buyers the most advanced 5.0-liter naturally aspirated Coyote V8 yet. The power plant may not be entirely brand new, but it's been significantly tweaked to be more potent, with the mandatory soundtrack accompanying it. We don't have specs for the Ford Mustang GT convertible engine just yet, but we know it will make at least 480 horsepower, up from 450 horsepower in the current iteration. Based on the 6th gen model's mid 4 second sprint to 60, we'd expect a 0 to 60 time in the low 4 second range for the new GT convertible. Power goes to the rear axle, and buyers can choose between a 6 speed manual transmission or a 10 speed automatic with rev matching. Six drive modes are available to change up steering effort, electronic stability control settings, engine response, and transmission shifts to suit your needs. And if your needs include track day shenanigans, you now also get an electronic drift brake that puts the power of sideways action in your hands. The Ford Mustang GT convertible can also be had with various additions in the form of performance packs. This includes a front tower brace, optional Magnarite active suspension, wider wheels and tires, a Torsen limited slip differential, and larger Brembo brakes at the back. The GT Performance Pack also equips brake ducts for better cooling and an auxiliary engine oil cooler. And for those who want everyone to know they drive a pony car, the new Stang allowing you to loosen up that V8's vocal cords from across the parking lot. There aren't official EPA figures just yet, but based on the 2022 Ford Mustang GT convertible's gas mileage, we can get an idea of what to expect. The current GT convertible manages 15-25-18 mpg on city-highway-combined cycles with the manual, while the auto version gets 1 mpg less on the highway. With more power under its newly sculpted hood, the 7th gen version won't likely do any better. Ford Mustang GT Convertible Interior and Cargo Like the other models in the lineup, the interior of the Ford Mustang GT Convertible shows the most significant update. While limited passenger space in the second row isn't likely to change, the rest of the space is substantially different. Inspired by the cockpit of a fighter jet, the new Mustang range is much more tech-focused and oriented towards the driver. There are two curved displays up front, including a 12.4-inch instrument cluster that uses the Unreal Engine 3D creation tool from video games to animate and display real-time renderings of the car's current setup. Additionally, the driver information cluster can flow seamlessly into the 13.2-inch infotainment display in the center stack. The infotainment screen runs Sync 4 software, and in keeping with the modernization of the Mustang, you'll find fewer physical buttons and dials than before a rather large step up from the very basic cabin of the current models. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are included, as is Amazon Alexa, and a bang in the Lufsen sound system is available for those who may want to drown out the sound of the engine for some reason. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.